Hello everybody, this is Dwayne. And if you are new to our channel, we want to say welcome. Thank you for watching. Any new subscribers out there? Hey, you guys, we want to say welcome also and thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. And for everybody that's been in the fam for a while, hey, we love to see you guys comment, like, and share, and watch the videos. Now, we just arrived at Talona Ridge, RV Resort in Ella J, Georgia. And I can tell you just by my, just by looking at it, it's, it's a fairly new resort, but man, it is nice. It is very, very nice. Would you say? I would say it's nice, guys. It is nice. Um, I think right now we are not, um, there's not a lot of other campers here. But I was just looking at their lineup for the holiday weekend. We gonna have some fun. <laughs> uh oh, and oh, there's the thunder. There's some thunder. So we're gonna cut this short because uh, I just got through setting up, but I wanted to give you a, at least a look at what it looks like with no campers here. We are on Falcon Ridge. There's three levels. There's one up there, I think that's Eagle. And then we're on the next level and then there's a level down below and back here you can see they say that we're going to get some thunderstorms and rain this afternoon and there it is now off in the distance that's the appalachian appalachian mountain chain so this is it i'm gonna go ahead and quickly finish getting things buttoned down and we will see you in just uh in the next clip we are very fortunate that we are across the street from the restroom, showers, laundry, and women's shower. Nice! Oh wow! Shower, nice toilet. Nice size shower, good gracious. And sink. See, there we are over there. And let's see. All right. Oh, nice laundry. We got two machines. Three dollars a piece. Maybe they had a combo of washer dryers. And then we got more restroom and shower. Family. Nice. Same same kind of setup. Shower. Sink. Cool deal. Got a convenient ice machine. You swipe a credit or a debit card, it unlocks the door, and you get your ice. 10 pound bag of ice is three bucks. Man, convenient. Look at the pool. How pretty.
the green. Look at there. Hi guys, this is Belinda from All About the Banks, and we're at one of our new favorite places now. Uh, but we're here with Elizabeth. Now, Hello, Elis how are y'all? Elizabeth is gonna give us a little information on Talona Ridge. Yes, so Talona Ridge, um, it has been in place not even a year. We started in November, actually being our first time to open up here, which was Eagle Crest. And we just opened it up here to the public. Then we started down at the very bottom on Hawk Valley and then came into the center of Falcon Ridge. Right. So we got the pool in in, the, in our December hours and stuff. And it just, the cold was not favorable. <laughs> it made concrete and setting of a pool very difficult. Okay. But as you see, you probably have been out there. It is a wonderful spot it's to beautiful. visit. Yes. And what's to come that a lot of people don't know is on the back side down at Falcon Ridge will be our next pool that will be child friendly with an outdoor barbecue area and uh, restrooms, grilling. It's just splash pad. So mm -hmm. it'll be very inviting for families down there. Okay, now we heard that Tolona has a meaning. And, uh, you know, we're from North Carolina, so everything in North Carolina has a meeting, meaning. So tell us what Tolona means. Well, I came to LAJ about in 2014. And so I started learning some of the history of what the mountains and the names mean about here. So Tolona, which is actually the mountain ridge over here off to the right, that's okay. on the other side of the pool. Tolona means poisoned witch. But as you see, we have found that the ground, if you look around all these rocks under one stone, all these rocks were had to be blasted out of here in order to get us a level landscape. So all your rocks are your cornerstone of one stone, which is Tolona Ridge. How cool is that, guys? See, you've learned something, and, and we didn't even know. Elizabeth is the... Re is the resident, <laughs> I'm going to call her the resident expert. <laughs> I am not your resident expert. So um, I actually was brought in by the family. So Scott, Wesley, and Will, they own it, the Hendersons. It is very family owned, locals to the area. It is not, never will be corporate. This is their baby um, and they started this initially broke ground. I want to say right at the beginning of 2001 and when I came in, this building that we are in currently, it was in stick frame. Oh, wow. Yes. So we knew the views were coming and we tried to keep everything at night. You will see there's the low lighting so that there, you're, you can still have your beautiful night sky to see the stars right. because it stays dark. So you have your night lighting and it's all, it's uplit instead of downlit so you're not blinded by the lights. Guys, another thing too that we found here in, in LJ, am I saying that right? Is it it's LJ, yes. Is in, in LJ, is that LJ is apple country. Yes. And we didn't know that we thought Georgia was peach country, but no, <laughs> no. up here. Um, so we have several of your vineyards, which you will, 
have been out to. I've heard um, BJ Reese Cider House, which we serve here at our little bar. Um, we have some of the locals. We offer everything you ha can have here is all locally grown and within the surrounding counties all the way out to Athens, Georgia. Um, so the peaches, they come out early. And a lot of your orchards here, they will have your peaches and you can go out and pick your own and you can go in to BJ Reese and you can, they'll have sampling stations and they'll have all your different peaches. So you have your early girls, your Georgia peaches, and it's good to know which ones you want to do for canning or make cobblers. Um, so there's those and then the apple season comes in. Come October, we are completely booked in October and these roads go from very vacant roads to a parking lot. It gets wow. that busy around here. Wow. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, Elizabeth, we are so excited that we had an opportunity to come here and that we've had the opportunity to meet Elizabeth and she has been so helpful and so knowledgeable of uh, Ella J and Telona Ridge. So guys, if you ever have an opportunity to come to Northern Georgia, North Georgia, North, North Georgia, to the mountains of Georgia. Who knew Georgia had mountains? <laughs> to the mountains of Georgia, you make sure you come to Talona Ridge. Talona Ridge, don't forget the name. Talona Ridge in Ella J, Georgia. <laughs> it was thank a pleasure and thank you so much for coming here. Thank you so much. All right. Bye-bye. Hi guys, this is Belinda again from All About the Banks. We are here with the world famous Fry Baby <laughs> Owners. Uh, we just met them. This is Leslie and Anissa, and I want them to share with you uh, a little bit about their business. Hey, everybody. We are a family, black-owned business, women-owned, and we run it ourselves, but we have loaded, <laughs> <laughs> all kinds of loaded fries, grilled cheese. We have monthly specials. This month, we're doing our bulgogi. You got bulgogi meat on it, kimchi, avocado crema it's 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 amazing and it's one of our top sellers so you have to come and try it out but we have all kinds of specials chicken steak we do loaded grilled cheese sandwiches tater tots sweet potato fries Homemade if it's cookies. potato baked potatoes we got it okay now tell us where you guys are from where you're you're out of we are out of marietta georgia and we go all over the city of the state of georgia and we just out there serving up fries. Like I say, we're a family and we're working together and making this work. Now, what made you guys go this route? What made, what was the, the catalyst to get you started? So I'm a nurse, been a nurse for 20 years. My daughter's a computer engineer and it was time for a change. All right. And I, I love to feed people. That's been my thing forever. I feed everybody. The, all the neighborhood <laughs> kids, they at my house, I feed them. <laughs> so it's like, you know what? We've been wanting to do this. We'd like to come up with creative recipes and mixes. And so it's like, why not? Yeah. COVID happened and we said, why not? It's, it's the time. Right. And we just went for it and took a shot. Okay. Now, Anissa, you are a, a young woman. So what is your, I mean, give us a little, as a young woman coming into a business like this, how do you feel? What do you think? Oh, yeah, it's definitely terrifying to just like put yourself out there, but it's exciting too, like to take an idea and just see how far you can go with it. I've always loved fries. I've always loved grilled cheese. I'm a big foodie and I spent, you know, a bunch of time at home making them. So people liked it. So being able to share a part of yourself without having to talk because I'm not an extroverted person <laughs> is great. <laughs> Wow, this is great, guys. Now, we actually have not tried it yet because we just walked up on them and started talking. You know I can run my mouth every now and then. So we started talking, but dinner time is coming up, and I think you're, you're going to be here? Yes, 5 to 9. We, we will you. be here. We will be here this afternoon. They will be here this afternoon. They're at Talona Ridge. They've set up here, and they're providing these goodies for all of the people here. So we're gonna try it out in a little bit. And uh, I'm sure it's a thumbs up. I can already feel it, you know, because we're big foodies anyway. You know you know how we eat, but I'm looking forward to it. So thank you girls so much. Thank, thank you, you for doing this. We appreciate yeah. it. I'm excited for you guys to try it. Thank yes. you. Yes. Wow. <laughs> well guys, we are still at Talona Ridge and it has been such a wonderful, uh, time here 
we met so many nice people we just did a little interview with uh, a, a business owner of fry baby and one of the staff members here at Tolona Ridge gave us a little interview and, and we really thank her for that. But as you can see behind me, this view from up on the top, this is the top of this is called Eagle Ridge. Now Eagle Ridge was the original, like she said, the original uh, part of the campground. And, and I see why they call it Eagle because it's up the highest point up on top of this campground and you can see 360 degrees all the way around you as you go around this park. So we are going to continue to bring you some uh, sights and sounds and things from here. Uh, man, but this is a wonderful park. If you get a chance and you're ever in Georgia, come by, uh, make your reservation. Man, it's just nice. That's all I can tell you. And that's, that's one of the things that we like about traveling the way we do we get to see some nice places some nice scenery and meet some nice people potato dish this is a meatloaf all the seasonings for meatloaf I'm gonna let it cook and then I come back and I put the mashed potatoes and all the good stuff on the top so while this is cooking stick with me This is the meatloaf, how it's come out. I drained some of the juice off of it. I'm going to squirt a little more um, barbecue sauce on the top. Now, I used the, the recipe called for regular potatoes. Ain't you nobody know, got time for cutting and all that stuff. I use the super duper instant potatoes, the kind with all the good stuff in it. Cheese you like. 
We just using triple cheddar. That's the little. Mm, I bet if we had some bacon, that would be good on top too. But we don't. So this is it. I'm gonna close it up. Let the cheese melt. And then we'll be ready to try this recipe out. Cheese is ready. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. The cheese has melted. And if I were at home, I'd probably put it in my oven and kind of brown the cheese a little bit, you know, and put a little broiler on it. Yeah, we're ready to eat. So this is gonna work. I'll show you what it looks like plated. Good morning guys, as you can see we are out here getting our walk in today and uh, hope you're doing good, hope you're having a great day and we hope that you at least started to walk. Even though it's warm out here, we got to get it in. We've made a commitment to you guys and some of you I hope have made a commitment to us. So we're going to do this thing. Yep, I got up and played pickleball this morning. And uh, that was fun. I, I used to play tennis. So it was a lot like playing tennis, just a shorter court. But man, I hadn't done that in a while. And I watched. Yeah, it, but it was fun. I think that's going to be something I'm going to try to add to my repertoire of uh, activities. All right, y'all, keep walking. Okay, guys, we are here at it again. Good morning. Another walking day. Hope that you are getting into your walking or whatever it is, stretching, yoga, um, Pilates, running, basketball. Be active. Pack pickleball. Pickleball. Yep. Pick, I played pickleball the other day and it was fun. I think that's something that I'm going to kind of add to my repertoire. I think I said that in another video. Check it out somewhere in here. I don't know. <laughs> All right. We got to go. Raining today. Rainy day duties. Wash clothes. The good thing is the laundry is right across the street from our site. So we don't have to go far. People have packed up and vacated the premises, but it's still a lot of folks here. 